Morning, everybody, and welcome back to another MLB The Show 18 Diamond Dynasty video. And as you guys can see in front of you, we basically lost all hope. <laughs> so, yeah, what we're going to do today is we're going to just go ahead and do another Battle Royale draft. Um, I have been doing these on stream, but to note but with absolutely no success the furthest i've gotten with a team from a draft um is six and zero this year uh but once i hit six and oh i can't win anything else to save my life but yeah this is basically going to be the only way i can test any expensive cards on the market like the uh like ronald acuna or miguel cabrera or any of that stuff because as you guys can see in the top right corner i don't have many stubs left so, uh, yeah, this is basically going to be the only way I can get, like, new high overall card debuts on the channel for you guys. But, yeah, that's what we're going to do in today's video. So, without further ado, let's just go ahead and waste 1,500 stubs and see what we get in the first round. And, yes, let's freaking go. Show's finest, Jose Ramirez, right off the rip. That's exactly the kind of card that we're looking for in these drafts. And then next round, they give us our second diamond round right after, right in our second round. Oh man, who do I go with here? Yeah, honestly guys, I don't know who to go with here. I don't know if I should go with the right power bat and Brian Dozier. I normally do really well with Brian Dozier's cards uh, in, the, in Diamond Dynasty. But there's also this Zach Britton card. He only has three pitches, but he does have that sinker and 108 hits per nine, along with that 99 velo. So it's kind of like, oh man, it's like you don't know who to go with here. You know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and go with the lefty in the bullpen, just because lefties are so hard to come by this year. Um, let's see. Next round is a silver round. I'm going to go ahead and take Lucas Duda. Take that lefty power bat. Next round is another silver. Um, 55 break for Dominguez. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that. I'll take another power bat in Evan Gaddis. All right, so we have our first gold round of the draft here. Um, let's see. Johnny Peralta, he's only really good against lefties. He's okay against righties. Not terrible, just okay. Um, Natali Feliz. I, have I used this card this year? I have. So let's see, he has a change up, a four seam change up and a slider. And then Blackman. I've done I've done fairly well with this Blackman card this year. Um let's see, I don't have anybody else in the bullpen really. Um I might take Char uh You know what? I think I might end up taking Charlie Blackman here just because just because I think I can get another that there are more, there are better, there are better silvers than this Naftali Feliz. If I'm being completely honest with you guys, or at least with better, uh, with that, at least with a better pitch selection. So you know what, we're gonna go ahead and take take Chuck Nasty. Here we go. This is what I need. All right. So let's see. Melanson. I don't like. I don't like using Melanson, honestly. So you know what, I think we'll go ahead and take Grandal. I do. I've done really well with him this year. Then we have our f other gold round. Let's see, Roberto Alomar, Starlin Castro, Michael Pineda, I mean Michael Pintar, my bad, and uh, Drew Smiley. I'm going to go ahead and take Drew Smiley here, just because Castro has below 40 power and anything below like 70 is useless, and then I, I can't use this Alomar card to save my life. I refuse to use him. Go ahead and take another lefty at, uh, for the pen. Here I'll go ahead and take, I guess I'll take Brock Holt get another guy off the bench Ooh, this guy actually looks good Edubre Ramos that's a that's a bit of a mouthful yeah we'll go ahead and take him he's not bad and then finally let yes get these common rounds out of the way like please all of them yes yes one more one more oh come on oh my god are you kidding me oh this is the last thing I wanted. I took, you know what? I should have taken the bronze starting pitcher over Ramon Torres. Gosh dang it. Um, I I don't know who to take here. I might just take Singrani. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just take Singrani. Gosh dang it. 
and we get our common round for the bench. Are you kidding? Oh my god. All right, whatever. It's it's fine, I guess. We'll we'll just have to work around it. I'll take Patty Barrels here. All right, yeah. Where do we need help? So let's see. Aguilar, he can't play anywhere else. Duda, I think, can play a corner outfield spot. Um, let's see where else. Shortstop and second base. All right, let, give me a minute and I'll come back and figure out figure out a decision. All right, I think we're gonna go ahead and take Jesus Aguilar here just because BR needs power. Um, yeah, I'll go ahead and take him there. I'll take probably Vogel back and speed round. We'll take him. All right, yeah. All right, let's go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and take a minute, set the lineup, and I'll get back to you guys here in just a minute. All right, so I think I figured out a decent lineup for this team. So I went ahead and threw Lucas Duda in left field. I'll have him lead off, followed by Jose Ramirez, Charlie Blackman, Jesus Aguilar, Yasmani Grandal, Evan Gaddis, Brock Holt, and Pat Vleka. Honestly, guys, I'm actually kind of liking this team. I mean, aside from Tony Singrani in our starting rotation, like overall, this team isn't bad. We have a couple good lefties in the pen. We have Aroides Vizcaino as a decent righty. We also have Romo. Um... You know, the bench is whatever, but the lineup, I'm actually liking it so far. So let's go ahead and try to find ourselves an opponent and get a win. All right, so we found ourselves an opponent finally. Uh, we're playing the Kitchener boss. He's got Ben Revere, Trevor Story, that 93 John Carlo, Chase Headley, George Springer, Mike Schmidt, Rugnit Odor, Russell Martin. Honestly, I'm looking at his team and I'm liking mine a little bit more than his. He does have that Stanton, but we have a lot of power on our side. Let's go try to get ourselves a victory. All right, so he's got Ben Revere leading it off. All right, so we got to try to keep him off base here because he's got 91 speed, and the last thing you want is either a power guy or a speed guy getting on. And and on because BR, that's just how BR plays this year, you know? All right, so he hit it to the second baseman, and Ben Revere beats that out. Oh my god, early and weak. I, what what can you do? What can you do at this point? All right, we're gonna go ahead and bring in Aroides Vizcaino here. Um, I need to warm up somebody else. I'm probably gonna end up warming up Sergio Romo here in a minute. Ooh, that's a good fastball. That is a great fastball from Vizcaino. That's, and then he's gonna swing at a sinker that almost hit him. Let's try to hit him with a slider down and away, and we got him check swing. That is strike three, called one away. Oh man, here comes Stanton. I am scared to pitch to this card, and he's stealing with Revere. He's swinging at the pitch, and Ben Revere is in scoring position now. That's not good. It's an 0-2 count on Stanton. Let's see if we can get him on the sinker, and that looked like a strike from the pit, from the rip, and oh my god, hmm, I don't know how you lay off that kind of a pitch, and Stan is grounding out to the shortstop, he's going to try to run to third, and I'm going to see if I can bait him, and we did, he's tagged out, almost, <laughs> he almost missed the tag, thank god he got, thank god he applied it, well, let's get some runs. Is Jose Ramirez at the dish. Let's see if he can get anything going. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm probably gonna take until he gives me a pitch that I can swing at, or at least a strike. I'm gonna put the controller down, and that one was kind of down the middle. Very hittable spot at least. Probably could have done something with it. And he throws another fastball down in the zone this time. Apparently I'm early on, a 92 mile an hour fastball. And he got us on the changeup. Are you freaking kidding me? Come on. All right, 3-0 count on Chuck Nasty here. He brought in Lou Trevino from the pen, and that was... Are you kidding me? That was a ball for him. That should be a ball for me. Oh, my God. And he works it back to a full count. That pitch, that pitch is out of the zone. You said that was out of the zone for him, so it should be out of the zone for me, but it doesn't matter. We're getting a base hit against the shift. And we're going to be able to get two out of this. We've got a runner in scoring position. I forget who's on deck, but, uh, yeah, Jesus Aguilar, try to bring Chuck Nasty around, please. And Aguilar, that is a fair ball. I don't know how that landed fair, but it did. 
15 speed that's only get us to that's only getting us to second but charlie blackman came around to score let's freaking go Ooh, he we got him biting at that slider that was a great location and a great hack and we get him on another slider out of the zone strike three one more out let's see if we can get him on a high heat we do he's swinging at everything now he seems a bit desperate for a hit got him swinging at the sinker again let's try the high and in sinker and he's fouling that one off all right let's try to get him on that slider again that was a really good pitch and we got him swinging on the slider let's go let's go try to get some insurance but patty barrels patty barrels a bronze shortstop He's hitting that one into the gap. Can we... You know what? I'm going to keep him at second. I'm not going to test anything. I need to try to get some sort of insurance this inning. And we're going to bring in Zach Britton. This is, be this is beautiful the way this, is, this game is playing out. Oh, man. He's what is he swinging at? He's looking silly on that pitch. And we're going to get him with the high heat. Strike three. Let's go. That's one out. We got a one-two count on his pinch hitter one more strike to end the game and we got him swinging at one of the worst pitches i have thrown all game doesn't matter we get ourselves the win that's our that's like it's like impossible to get wins in battle royale this year i don't know why that's just the way the game plays this year but i'm just happy that we were able to walk away with it For, walk away from this episode with a victory Overall, guys, this team actually isn't bad. Again, aside from Singrani in the starting rotation, which just happened by chance, overall the team, like the lineup, is really, like, really, really good in my opinion. You know, Lucas Duda, Jose Ramirez, Blackman, Aguilar, Gaddis, uh, Grandal, like they're not bad. And even Pat Vileka, he he got a double for us in that first game. He's not he's not terrible either. And then the bullpen, you know, it, it it's whatever. You know, Aroides Vizcaino, he's usable. Same with Zach Britton and, you know, Romo and Smiley. Overall, I think this team can actually, could possibly get us to 12-0, but I'm not going to speak too soon, even though I just said, I just spoke to, you know what, whatever. You get what I'm on about. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. I'll see you guys in the next one. And as always, have a great rest of your morning.